Question 13. An expression for the nth term of a sequence of triangular numbers is n and in brackets n plus 1 over 2. Prove that the sum of any two consecutive triangular numbers is a square number. Or trying to prove that the sum, which just means adding them up together, of two consecutive, consecutive just means numbers that are next to each other, triangular just means the numbers that we get out when we put something into here, and square number is just a number that's been multiplied by itself, so it's going to have a squared in it at the end. How can we have two consecutive numbers? The first number could be n, and the number next to it could be n plus 1, or it could be n minus 1, the one before it. Just to make it easier, we're going to use n plus 1, so that we're sticking with positives. I've got, for my first number, n, and in brackets, n plus 1 over 2. And for my second number, I'm going to substitute n plus 1 wherever I see n. So I'm adding n plus 1. I'm swapping that in with an n plus 1. And this n is also going to change to an n plus 1. So n plus 1 plus 1 over 2. Let's expand this bracket out, and we'll expand this out and clean it up a little bit. So n multiplied by n is n squared. n multiplied by 1 is n. That's over 2. Then for this one, we're going to clean up this bit inside the bracket. So n plus 1 plus 1 would become n plus 2. So I've got n plus 1 for my first bracket, and then n plus 2 for my second bracket. That's over 2. And you need to expand this bracket out next. So I'm doing n squared plus n over 2 plus this one out this bracket. So I'm doing n times n is n squared and a quick way to do this if you do 1 add 2 it gives you 3 so I've got plus 3n and 1 times by 2 is 2 so plus 2 that's just a quick way of expanding double brackets now because I've got a common denominator of 2 I can collect up all of the terms on the top so I've got n squared plus n squared which is 2n squared that's those done n plus 3n which is 4n and then I've got this 2 that's just left over that's been divided by 2 so everything on my top is being divided by 2. This is going to disappear. So I'm going to rewrite it as n squared. 4n divided by 2 is 2n. And 2 divided by 2 is 1. So now I need to prove somehow that this is a square number. Could I factorize this? I'm looking for two numbers that multiply to make 1. And they're going to add to make 2. So this one's quite simple. The only factors of 1 are 1 and 1. So in my first bracket is n plus 1. And in my second bracket will also be n plus 1. And I can rewrite this so that it's more obvious that it's a square number. Because it's the same thing that's being multiplied by each other, I'm just going to write it as n plus 1 in bracket squared. And this will prove that it's a square number.